So I am so overjoyed to be here at the Flannery O'Connor Childhood Home in Savannah, Georgia. And I'm here today with Cody Shelley, the foundation manager of the Childhood Home. And I'm just going to turn it over to her because she has amazed me with fascinating <laughs> facts about the childhood of Flannery O'Connor and really all of her life. So I'm going to turn it over to the expert. Here's Cody. <laughs> Hi, welcome. We would love for you to come visit the Flannery O'Connor Childhood Home here in Savannah because we can offer you a wealth of insight into Flannery, her childhood and her writing. There's nothing like experiencing the childhood home to understand how deeply Flannery's Catholicism is rooted in her life and childhood. You can't understand it until you see the view of St. John the Baptist Cathedral from her crib upstairs or the backyard where she played with her chickens as a child. So we'd love to have you here. It's a beautiful home. We're restored back to the 1920s and 30s. We're the only museum here in Savannah like that. It's a town that focuses mostly on the 19th century. So we're pretty proud to be a Depression era museum here in Savannah. And we'd love you to join us. We'd love you to experience Flannery's childhood, connect with her here, understand where she's coming from when she writes from Milledgeville later in life. And uh, we hope you'll come and join us on Charlton Street in Lafayette Square in Savannah, Georgia. It's definitely worth the journey. <laughs>